The Wildcats are looking to bounce back from two consecutive losses when they take on the Kings at Challenge Stadium on Sunday. The Cats are feeling positive and can take comfort in the fact that they are yet to lose to Sydney since they rejoined the NBL in 2010. You know, we're upset, that, you know, we, of course, that we lost those two games, but I think it's pretty positive, you know, a couple other teams dropped a few, you know, games, so we're still definitely in the race, uh, you know, for that top spot, and that's, that's what we're, you know, going with, and, you know, the mood's, the mood's fine, you know, we, you know, you're bound to lose some games in the season, and, you know, we just have to get back and, you know, get back at it. There's no doubt about that. Uh, we, we had a, a terrific month last month, uh, played two very, very tough games and, and got beat. So it's important for us to re-establish ourselves, redefine who we are as the Wildcats. And that's what we're, we're challenging our players this week is to get back to the up-tempo, to be a lot more aggressive and uh, a lot, lot more free-flowing. The Kings currently lead the NBL in rebounds per game with an average of 40.4 and their centre, Julian Kazoo, leads all players with an average of 10.8 per game. Keeping the Kings off the glass will be another big focus for the Cats. They're a big team as well, so we have to kind of take them off the boards and just limit deep catches inside and just make their guards try and hurt us. So, you know, we have a great, you know, defensive unit and if we, you know, back each other up, we should be, you know, should be fine. Last year we were the leading rebounding team, probably the last two years, the number one team in the league and that, that's why, uh, you yeah, know, we, we've done well. You give yourself uh, a chance to win every game and uh, you know, we, we totally out-rebounded by Cairns. They were more determined and, uh, you yeah, that's what we've spoken to the guys about. It's simply not good enough to get out-rebounded and, uh, that's a real emphasis this week. On the previous 61 occasions these sides have met, the Cats lead the head-to-head 31-30, -to -head including the past five straight, a trend that will hopefully continue on Sunday. For Cats TV, I'm Jordan Teo.